Good morning, everyone. This is Lolly. Uh, yesterday, actually, I had some opportunity to tea stain some more paper, and I wanted to tea stain something besides copy paper, so I wanted to show you the results. Um, I am a big fan of graph paper, so I wanted to do some of that, and I decided not to do any crinkling. You, you know, when I did my tea staining uh, video, I crinkled the paper, but I wanted to see what it would be like flat. It's still really cool. You could see the graph paper there really really like this so that's one and a lot of the decorative paper that I have it's very cheap quality I had gotten a huge stack at the thrift store and I just wanted to use it up so this was before staining and because it's so dark it really doesn't show a whole lot of difference in tea staining the back looks more stained than the front this one super bright super bright <laughs> but look at it can you see the pattern in there and so there's the box. Many of these are just really uh, bright colors and I thought, Ugh, I'd never use them right, but, and then that's one stained. This one, of course, it's got splotches because I was dripping on it accidentally as I was doing my paper. This one's got a little pattern on it and that's the finished one. Really like that as well. This one, <laughs> I'm not a big orange fan, but still, it's like really bright. But then look at that tea stain, looks really great. Looks very aged. And I have some pink. That turned out really well, too. It really muted that color down for me, aged it. Looks like it's really old. This one has very soft colors in it, blue. And it's very hard to see that pattern. I hope that shows out for you. Another orange one. Definitely like these a lot. And this one I was really surprised with, pleasantly surprised how well that turned out. I love it how that aged. And the last one I have is this one. And that turned out really cute too. Really fond of that. So be collecting your decorative paper and don't give up on it. I mean, you know, we don't know until we do it how well it's going to turn out. And I'm really happy with these. These are going to make some really cute journals.